neurons talk to each other using both together to form a network of neurons. Instagram. It was launched as a People have social. found ways to be connected, updated, and socially active. Facebook. The largest and one of the most. Para sa sarili lamang. Which means we cannot live alone. We all need other people. Most especially our family and friends. Morning class, welcome to our new lesson. I am Teacher Rico, your grading teacher for today, and this is Trends, Networks, and Critical Thinking in the 21st Century. Get ready and let's start the exciting journey right away and learn and study PNCD at your own pace and time. As we start, let us ask for God's intervention so we will be guided throughout the whole duration of our lesson. Let us pray. Our Heavenly Father, we thank you for the opportunity to begin this new day. As we begin our class, we ask you to give us the knowledge and wisdom that we need to help us understand our lesson today. Please bless my students and help them as they grow. May I teach them faithfully the things they need to know so they may face the future knowing they are prepared. We pray that you will guide us in all ways, so that we will seek your will in everything that we do. We bring back all the glory and honor. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. In this lesson, you are going to learn about neural networks, social networks, and establishing linkage between South and the social networks. You have learned already in our previous lesson the difference between connections, relationships, and networks, wherein network is defined as a group of individuals who collaborate with each other to be able to achieve a common purpose and connection. The word network consists of two words, net and work, which quite mean working like an app, which means a combination of lines that work as one. Every individual is a part of global network society. Through the use of technology, humans can easily connect to each other in the different corner of the world. Everything was created in this world to serve their own purpose and obligation. How about you? How much do you know about the reason of your existence? What will be your role or function in this world or in the society where you live in? Why do you need to connect with others or to be belong to social networks? Let's find out! And after this lesson, you are expected to compare the neural networks with social networks. And we also have the subtasks which are define neural networks and social networks. Explain the importance of neural networks and social networks and enumerate the advantages and disadvantages of social networks. Now let's have a simple activity. Arrange the following jumbled letters and use the arranged words to complete the sentences that will be shown. You have 20 seconds to answer the questions. Are you ready? Let's begin. Number one. Get ready to the countdown. The function of the human brain can be associated with the society. It seems that you answered it easily. Number two. Get ready to the countdown. Social media enable users to create and share content or to participate in social networking. Did you get the correct answer? 
Great. Number three. Get ready to the countdown. Collaboration, participation, and interaction are important skills that we must possess in this world nowadays. Number four. Get ready to the countdown. The enormous development in technology is an important phenomenon in the 21st century. Finally, get ready to the countdown. To achieve an ordered community, it must have linkages and connections. Did you get all the correct answers? Very good! These are just some of the essential terms that have something to do with our topic. Let's get going. Let's dig deeper to the meaning of these terms. Social network and neural network. What do you think is the corresponding meaning of these terms? A or B? Correct! Social network is a group of social interactions and personal relationships or a dedicated website or other application which enables users to communicate with each other by posting information, comments, messages, and images. A neural network is a computer architecture in which a number of processors are interconnected in a manner suggestive of the connections between neurons and a human brain and which is able to learn by a process of trial and error. Neural networks are also ideally suited to help people solve complex problems in real-life situations. The social network is made up of humans, while neural network is made up of neurons. But in both networks, individual entities mutually influence each other as participants in a group. Each part has a function and contributes to the whole network. The human brain is composed of neurons, which spreads messages from one nerve cell to another and set together to form a network of nerves. Neurons communicate with each other, relaying messages throughout your body and powering all of your thoughts and actions. Neurons talk to each other using both electrical and chemical signals. Messages stored as electrical signals traveling rapidly down a neuron. These signals are called action potentials. When they reach the gap between two neurons, the messages need some help to get across. The information is transformed from an action potential into a chemical message which crosses the gap called a synapse. The release of those chemical messengers can trigger an action potential in the neuron or the other side of the synapse, conveying the message onward or it can quiet the message. This happens over and over and over, and with repeated activity, the synapse gets stronger so the next message is more likely to get through. That way, neurons learn to pass on important messages and ignore the rest. This is how our brain learn and adapt to an ever-changing world. The brain regulates the whole system of the body. Each part has its own function, 
but one part cannot function effectively without the other. The functions of the human brain can be compared to the society. The society is made up of different social groups and various types of people with different attitudes, characters, and functions. Let's compare. Neural and social network are both channels for linkage and interconnection. Neural network connects nerve cells. It keeps the body alive. And the message is transmitted by neurons in seconds. And the response is appropriate to particular body parts. Well, social network links people. It maintains kinship ties or common interests so that members continue to accomplish things together. And in social network, the verbal and nonverbal languages as well as technology are used for linkage and interconnection. And the responses may be different from others. To achieve this, each group and individuals need to interact and connect with each other and most especially they need to do their part and function within the society. And failure to do so will lead to misunderstanding, conflict, and serious problems which may result to the failure of an individual, organization, or a group. There should be linkages, collaboration, and participation. As the saying goes, no man is an island. Walang sino man ang nabubuhay para sa sarili. Walang sino man ang nabubuhay para sa sarili lamang. Which means we cannot live alone. We all need other people. Most especially our family and friends. Social networks may include social institutions that focus on meeting our social needs, like schools that serves as foundation for knowledge and skills, church for spiritual guidance, family for procreation, economy for products and services, media for information and entertainment, government to protect us from our rights. Nowadays, people are attached active and living with social networking platforms and apps like Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and others which became their common daily activity. If our brain regulates body functions, social groups or networks are also regulated by laws to protect the rights of every member and to maintain peace and to avoid conflicts. The demands of the digital society due to the enormous development of technology in the 21st century brings humanity to embrace the online world. Today, life has been shaped by the bips of social networking signs. People have found ways to be connected, updated, and socially active on the internet which became possible with the advent of the numerous social networking platforms and apps like the following. Facebook, the largest and one of the most widely used social networking sites in the world. Yes, you heard it clearly. The first that surpassed the landmark of 1 billion user accounts. WhatsApp, it is an instant messaging platform that exists as an independent entity which captures the imagination of millions of people by having the ability to communicate and share instantly with individuals and groups. Instagram It was launched as a unique social networking platform that was completely based on sharing photos and videos. Thus, this enables us to capture the best moments of our lives. It allows us to apply multiple filters to photos and easily post them to other popular networking sites. Twitter It enables us to post short text messages containing a limited number of characters to convey your message to the world. YouTube the world's largest video sharing social networking site that enables users to upload and share videos, view, comment, and like. On the other side, we must be vigilant to some of the disadvantages of social networks. With that being said, let me give you the opportunity to provide at least three disadvantages and three advantages of social network in a span of five minutes. Are you ready? Alright, 
Time starts now! Let me up with a bright smile on now To me in the dark, to one gallows now To the moonlight
Time's up! In this activity, your answers will vary, but here are some answers for the advantages. You can meet new acquaintances or friends. You can communicate in long hours with other users. You can easily access news and important information. It's simple and easy to communicate. There are more opportunities for doing and developing business. And for the disadvantages, you might encounter or experience bullying or cyberbullying and social pressure, spread wrong information or fake news, distraction from business or work, health problems, and confidentiality risks. Were you able to accomplish the task? <laughs> Wow! Excellent! Now let's try another activity. In 10 minutes, let's compare social network and neural network. Are you ready? Let's begin!
Time is up. Let's check your work. Did you finish the task successfully? Yeah! Earn more points by writing three things that you have learned today and write the activity that you enjoy doing. Post your answers in the comment box and plus points will be given to those who will respond on the first three minutes. You may start now! Time is up! Wow, that's wonderful! I'm glad to know that you have learned and enjoyed in our lesson and activities today. Alright, let's check if how much you have learned. Read and understand carefully each item. Choose the letter of the correct answer.
It's the end of our short quiz. Here are the letters of the correct answers. Number 1, C. Number 2, A. Number 3, D. Number 4, D. Number 5, D. Number 6, C. Number 7, down to 10, is D. Did you get a perfect score? Excellent! Yeah! Now for your assignment, do these activities. Number one, me and my family. You are going to illustrate your part or function in your family through symbol or drawing and give a short explanation about it. Number two, it is entitled, Bayo Ko, Pakinggan Mo. You are going to make a slogan that contains an advice to the youth in using social networks. Use this rubric as your guide. Congratulations! I commend you for actively participating in our lesson and for completing the activities. Do you have any question? I hope that you will apply the things that you have learned not only for yourself but also for the benefit of men. Again, this is Teacher Rico that tells you to always have a positive outlook even in times of trials. God bless you all.